Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix Steam game recording not working on Windows PC and Mac. In more ways than one, the arrival of the native game recording feature is a welcome addition to Steam. As someone who spends a good chunk of his life looting, shooting and hacking games, this new add-on has already made it to my special playlist. But that hasn't been the case for a handful of gamers out there. While some have reported that the Steam game recording is not working at all, point blank, others have complained that it's not yet available on their devices. If you're also on the same fence, check out these 7 pretty reliable tips and tricks to fix the problem. That said, let's get started. Bear in mind that the game recording feature is still pretty new. As a result, there could be quite a few games that might not yet be on board. Therefore, ensure that your game is compatible with Steam's native game recorder. Then I would recommend you to update the Steam desktop client on your device. To begin with, ensure that the Steam desktop client is updated on your device. If you are still running the outdated version of the video game distribution platform, it could be the major reason why the game recording feature is not yet showing up. Just head over to the Steam desktop client and then hit the Steam menu located at the top left. And then you have to select check for updates and then do the needful. Alternatively, navigate to the App Store or Microsoft Play Store and then hit the updates or library tab in the left sidebar and then find the Steam app and update it just like any other app. And now it's the right time to master the two easy ways to record games in Steam. To out of any confusion, I would recommend you to make sure to master the multiple pretty straightforward ways to record games in Steam. Just head into the Steam menu at the top left corner of the screen and then choose the settings option. And then you have to scroll down in the left sidebar and choose the game recording option. And then ensure that record manually, control plus F11 or record in the background option is selected. Besides, you can head into Steam and then kick start again. And then look for the Steam overlay and then you have to hit the game recording option and then go about the job. After that, navigate to the view menu at the top and then choose recording cell screen source option to check your recordings. Then I would recommend you to ensure that your device has enough storage. If you can't save your recordings yet, make sure that your computer is not cluttered for space. On your Mac, head into the System Settings app and then choose the General option. After that, select Storage and then check the storage status and take all the required measures to wipe out the clutter to reclaim as much storage space as possible. And if you are using a Windows device, just head into the Start menu and then choose the Settings tab. After that, select the System tab in the left sidebar and then choose the Storage option. Then have a look at the storage consumption status and then go your all out to declutter your device. Then I would recommend you to record slightly lower quality video to prevent your storage from being clogged up. Steam provides a dedicated way to let you manage the video resolution depending on your needs. It goes without saying that the higher the video resolution, the higher the file size. Just head into the Steam menu at the top left and then choose Settings. And then you have to scroll down a bit and choose Game Recording. And then you have to scroll down to Video Settings section. Here you should see 5 pivotal options including Recording Quality. It lets you choose the quality of your recording. So whether you prefer higher resolution or smaller file sizes, just hit the drop down menu and then select the desired resolution. GPU hardware encoding. It allows you to turn on or off GPU hardware encoding to enhance performance. If you're dealing with lower end systems, it can prove to be pretty handy. HEVC Video Codec Get the most out of this option for more efficient compression and smaller file sizes. Maximum Frame Rate For smooth and consistent recording, it would be better to set the maximum frame rate. Maximum Video Height Now fine-tune the video height to match your desired recording aspect ratio. Then I would recommend you to change the Steam Game Recording folder should the problem persist. Try changing the game recording folder. 
To do so, just head into the Steam client and then choose the Steam menu located at the top left and then select settings and then select game recording. And then you have to scroll down to the game recording section and hit the change folder button. And then you have to select the preferred folder and then you have to restart your device to make the change come into effect. And finally, I will recommend you to reinstall the Steam desktop client. If nothing has worked in bringing the game recording functionality back on track, delete the Steam desktop client and reinstall it. But before going ahead, make sure to fully back up all of your games. To do so, just head over to Steam library and then right click the game's title and then choose the properties option. And from the install files tab, choose backup game files. After that, click on the browse option to browse to the folder where you would like to create the backup files. And then you have to hit create backup to start the backup process. And when the backup is complete, select open folder in order to move a burned copies of the backup files based on the requirement. Next up, you have to restore games from the backup files. After you have reinstalled the Steam client, sign in to the correct Steam account. And then you have to click on Steam menu in the upper left corner of the screen and choose Restore Game Backup. And then you have to browse to the location of the game's backup files and restore your games. And there you have it. Hopefully the game recording feature has returned to normal and so has your gaming. Now feel free to say your feedback about your savior and I'll catch you up in the next one with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a good time. Bye-bye.